A burglary suspect hopping walls in the backyards and breaking into homes. It happened in the southern part of the valley. Now, even after being confronted by homeowners, uh, police say this guy still went to the next house and tried it yet again. 13 Action News anchor Yasmin Hassan explains the simple and inexpensive things that you can do to protect your home. Yasmin, this area even has a neighborhood watch, and that didn't stop this guy. So what could have stopped him? I talked to a security expert to find out what areas around your home are the most vulnerable to break-ins. It's hard. It's hard. You don't have that sense of security anymore. After a guy broke into home after home yesterday, right near Warm Springs in Valley View, you can't blame neighbors for feeling that way. One man's security camera caught police and the K-9 unit rushing to catch Antonio Torre de Leon after multiple break-ins. Police say he broke a window to get into the first house. Now, to protect yourself, you can apply a security film on your windows. That makes it more difficult for anyone to break the glass and to see inside your home. They love breaking glass on sliding glass doors, French doors, uh, because it's safety glass. So they do shatter. They break the glass and walk right through, never have to open the door. You can make your house less of a target by buying a security rod. It's an adjustable bar that you can mount in the middle of a patio door, making it more difficult to get through from the outside. Finally, take a close look at your landscaping. It should always be away from the house. You want to keep the uh, trees and shrubs trimmed away from the home. Don't give the uh, bad guys a place to hide. As far as that suspect, he has been taken into police custody and he's facing a number of charges, including burglary and assault with a deadly weapon.